Now, with so much uncertainty this school year, some frustrated parents are taking their children's education into their own hands. Yeah, homeschooling is becoming a popular option. This morning, Catherine Ross joins us with why some parents say they're making the switch to ensure that their kids are ready for school. Against me. Four active kids keep Katherine Seisler on her toes. Okay, it's their goal. Three of them rely on individualized education plans. So when COVID-19 forced learning online, school became a challenge. It is impossible for one person to be monitoring all four of them at the same time with online work. Uh, so that was the big difficulty. Following a difficult spring term and growing health concerns, Seisler is changing tactics. Erin, are you excited about getting homeschooled? Yeah, I'm really excited. My husband and I were very anxious about this shift and whether or not, you know, we're going to be good teachers, whether we're going to be able to handle our kids, whether our kids are going to stay focused and like it. You know, there's a lot of anxiety. And they aren't alone. Homeschooling groups are seeing so much interest, many are offering advice and resources to first timers. I see a lot of desperate moms and dads just reaching out saying, This is my first time. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm, you know, of course, I'm one of them. Seisler hopes to eventually send her kids back to school, but says she plans to make the most of their time at home. That we all come out of it alive, number one. Number two, I hope to instill a love of learning for my kids. Local for you, Catherine Ross, NBC4. And if you are considering homeschooling, there are a lot of resources available from other homeschooling families on how to get started. And we have added that list to the story on our website, NBC4i.com. I'm sure it's something a lot of parents are thinking yeah, about as we absolutely. go through this. Stay